The last bits of snow are finally melting in West Virginia, and that means it's time to start pulling our favorite kind of garlic out of the ground. Ramps are one of the state's most celebrated foods, but what exactly can you make them? 7 News reporter Colin Ruth picked up a fork and found out. Aside from pepperoni rolls, you'd be hard-pressed to name a Mountain State food more recognizable than ramps. It may be pungent, but we love it, and West Virginians don't even have to go to the store to get some. The power of the wild onion isn't lost on state tourism chef ambassador Matt Welsh, who runs Wheeling's Vagabond Kitchen restaurant and is using its harvest season as an opportunity for some eclectic dishes. When we eat ramps or people who love ramps, it's almost like you're celebrating your, your history, right? Like, this is my culture. He says that while it may be something of a niche ingredient, its applications are anything but. Well, showed me a cream cheese ramp dip, a ramp pesto, and even says he recently made a ramp latka. But today we're keeping it simple with a fried ramps and potatoes demonstration. The bulbs kind of are like garlic. Okay. But then the tops are, they still taste uh, garlicky, but the tops act more like basil. So you kind of get two ingredients in one plant. Right, or two applications. You'll need both the ramp bulbs and greens for this dish. After that, it's just a matter of cutting up some potatoes, pouring some oil in the pan, and adding a touch of salt and pepper. We'll let all this cook together, and then we'll finish it with the greens. And after some conversation between us about gas stoves and cooking potatoes, it was time for the moment of truth. He finished it off with some fry sauce, and... It's great. You should try it, for <laughs> sure. It's a... It's a um traditional West Virginia staple of the springtime and it just tastes good and stuff and when you can go out and gather it in your yard like how much cooler is that all natural yeah kind of food yeah exactly in the ground today in a dish tomorrow how's that for almost heaven reporting in Wheeling I'm Colin Roos working for you all right Colin that was great you're missing out if you haven't had Vagabond Kitchen's camp kitchen's ramp recipes Welsh post them on YouTube under a channel called the Vagabond Chef